Good morning, second graders. Welcome to week seven of our art classes. Uh, last week, we did the rainbow ball, which is our color wheel. These are all the rainbow colors that we studied, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and violet. And we're going to turn those colors into a beautiful picture of hot air balloons floating up in the sky, plus include a rainbow over here on the side and color it in with crayon blue. Before we get started though, I want to show you pictures of the hot air balloon. What is that, Mrs. Story? Well, people go into these big balloons that are full of hot air and it goes way up in the sky. So there's tiny people here in those baskets and they turn on fire so that the fire makes it go up. And so there's lots of different colors and look how high they went. That is so cool. So now I'm going to go here and show you another picture of the fire part. All right, do you see that? Look at that. There is a fire right here and the fire makes the, hair, the air hot. And so the air that's hot, it goes up, it pushes the balloon up. And when they wanna come down, they lower the fire into a tiny little fire and it cools the air down. And so the cool air goes down and brings everybody down to the ground again. Pretty neat, huh? All right, so let's get started with our hot air balloon picture. We're gonna need a white piece of paper like this. And of course, all your markers that are on the rainbow color wheel. So we need red marker. We need orange snips. Then we need yellow, and then let me see, green. We need our green marker. We need our blue marker and our purple marker. Remember that was a violet color? All right, we also need our black marker to do some drawing with it, okay? But not yet. We're going to start over here now, and we're going to do six ovals that means six of these different colors on your paper so we're going to start with red because that's the first color and you can put it anywhere on your picture mm, i'll put my big red oval over here but you can put it in another part and color it in here's my big red oval and then you see how i put my top on my markers every time so they don't get dried out I'm going to do orange oval. Hmm, how about right here? Big orange oval. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. And then my yellow oval. Um, I'll put it right here. My big yellow hot air balloon is going to go right here. Color it all in. And then my... Oh, green is next, so I'm going to put a green hot air balloon right here. Do, 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 do. And then I am going to do blue is next. Let's see what space I have. Oh, I have a space right down here for Mr. Blue. Hot air balloon. Color it all in. And then I have purple is the last rainbow color. I'm going to put purple over here like this. And then I'm going to put my black and start drawing in. All right, so I have my black marker now and I'm going to then do the baskets underneath the hot air balloons. So it's basically like a square or a rectangle and you put three lines, one, two, three, you see? And then here's another one, one, two, three. Here's another basket underneath the yellow hot air balloon. And another one over here, one, two, three. Another one right here, one, two, three. And another one over here, one, two, three. Easy peasy. Now I'm going to put basket lines in there so it looks like a basket and it looks different than the hot air balloon. And then I'm gonna put people and let's put people in there having a good time. Hi, everybody. I'm way up high. 
Me too. I'm flying with him. Yeah. This is so much fun. Hey, we're having a birthday party over here. Hi, everybody. Meet my partner. Yeah, we know how to fly this hot air balloon. It's pretty cool up here. There we go. Let's put in more people right over here. Hi, everyone. Hello. There they are. Having a good time flying up in the air. So fill in all your balloons with people flying up in the air. Hey, I'm not finished yet. Those guys are happy. Maybe they're celebrating a wedding. Maybe it's somebody's anniversary or a birthday party. Hi, everyone. Yeah, we're having a good time too. Hey, I think there's sandbags on the sides of the balloons too. Don't forget your sandbags. If you let go of your sandbags, your balloon goes higher up in the air because the sand is heavy. Now, we're gonna decorate our balloons with all our lines that we did. Remember the lines that we did on your sleeping blanket? There they are again. They work every time. This'll be my zigzag balloon. And this'll be my dotted line balloon. Do, 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 do. It works really well to decorate our balloons. And here's our checkered. Didn't we do checkered lines, vertical and horizontal? Yep, there they are. Hey, this is looking pretty neat. Wavy lines will work very good here. Wavy lines, Z diagonal lines will work. And then maybe some thick lines. Oh yeah, broken lines will work in here. All right, now we've got all our hot air balloons decorated. We are doing the sky. Clouds, clouds, and maybe it's raining a little bit, right? Because of the rainbows. Birdies are way up high. And they're so far uh, up in the air that you can make uh, mountains down here. Remember that one picture and they had all kinds of mountains? They're so high up in the sky. And then another cloud, birdies, do, 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 do. And right here, I'm going to make my rainbow. Let's see, how many colors was that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to color in my rainbow with the rainbow colors. Red is always first. And then yellow, I mean, and then orange, and then yellow. Don't get your colors mixed up. Rainbows are never mixed up. And then green. And remember, second graders, you can pause the video anytime and go slow and careful. And then you're going to upload this into Canvas. Say here, Mrs. Story, this is what I did. Or you were absent and are looking at this, bring your picture with you after seeing it in, in Canvas. Now, here's with the coloring. I'm gonna use my basket with this kind of brown crayon because the brown marker is way too dark. That's way too dark. And my blue marker, look how dark it goes. So we don't wanna do the sky with the blue marker. It is too dark. So here's my baskets. Mm -hmm. Everybody has a basket, and it looks like a basket. You see? They're like texture lines in there, texture and bumpies. That would be perfect. And of course, my mountains are brown. Do, 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 do. And the very last thing you do is the blue sky. Look how beautiful that blue sky is. Now look. Blue against blue, it didn't hurt my picture at all. You know why? Because it's soft. The crayons are soft and they go fast too. They really color in good. So when you're done, it looks like this. You see, I added the mountains. You don't have to add the mountains, I guess, but it looks much better with the mountains. So good luck with this and do a good picture and then Show it to Mrs. Story when you have time. Thank you guys and see you next week. 
Bye.